A Weedle? What's he, is he going to teach me how to capture a Pokemon when I've already done this? <laughs> I literally just spent like 15 minutes trying to catch a Pidgey and then training that Pidgey up. Oh, well done. You've caught a bloody Weedle. There, now tell me. That was educational, was it not? <laughs> and here, take this too. We've got a Teachy TV. I think that's just for like tutorials and stuff. I don't really know. I just turned my sound down. Um, because like, <laughs> I had to check to see whether me turning the sound down on my record uh, on my screen would turn the sound down on the recorder on OBS, and it doesn't. But then I had to like turn the sound back up to check that, <laughs> and then forgot to turn it back down. The doors are locked. Oh, you can't do Viridian's gym yet. You have to go to, is it Pewter? Pewter City Gym. Oh. I completely forgot that this wasn't the right place. Holy shit. I can't believe that I forgot that. Wait, I should probably go speak to those people. Viridian Forest. I... I actually do have a Rattata. Do you want a Rattata? Because I can go get you a Rattata. Because I don't want it. <laughs> I just got it for the sake of having it. I don't actually want it. Um, we can give this girl a Rattata. I think she might give us something in return for it. Okay, let's withdraw a Rattata. -ta -ta. There we go. Oh. Yeah, I am. Um, oh, I'm hoping that I will get to play at least three generations of Pokemon on the channel. Um, obviously, first, second, and third gens. I don't know if my laptop could really handle um, a DS generation. Um, I don't really know. I don't know how hardware sort of like straining they are. Can I give you this Rattata? Yes, I have a Rattata. Can I give it to you? I'm, sh I'm sure you can give this girl a Rattata. Here. Am I lying? I'm lying. <laughs> you can't give this girl a Rattata. <laughs> this is the worst betrayal. Okay. So we've got our Pidgey, nicknamed Spear. Uh, thanks to a friend. And I don't know if they are aware that there's a Spearow in one of the future generations. I think it's Gen 3. Um, no, I think that might be Talo. No, Spearow's in this, isn't it? <laughs> what am I on about? Completely forgot that Spearows exist. Um, but yeah, I guess, I don't know, maybe they're related. Maybe it's a crossbreed. Not a Caterpie. Do we want a Caterpie? I don't really know if we do. What does it turn into? It turns into a Metapod and then a Butterfree. Maybe? Maybe? I can't remember what type Butterfree is. Let's, let's cap it anyway. Just for the sake of having it. Boom. Caterpie was caught. Okay, no, I'm not interested in naming it. It's, it's, oh no. Oh no, I forgot to grab the Pokeball. <laughs> not a Kakuna. A Kakuna. We don't want that. Get it away, a Harden. Can I just run away from it? Cause it's just gonna keep hardening. There we go, we can just run away. <laughs> I really don't care about it. We found a potion, brilliant. It saves me a little bit of money. Right, what I want to do is I want to swap out Falafel with Spear because we're going to get Spear leveled up a little bit before we get to the gym. Because I think, obviously, like, we can level Spear up through the gym, um, but Falafel's going to completely, like, destroy um, the rock Pokemon with that bubble attack. Oh, what's going on here? Why is it just... It's just come on me. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> For why? Please explain. 
Also, in the end, yeah, I, did I mention it? In the end of the last episode, I had to do two episodes for this, two, two episodes, two intros for this, to test out the sound. But in the other intro, I think, maybe I did it in this one, but I mentioned that <laughs> I asked if you guys wanted to see more of this, and I'm already sat recording more of it already. Um, so that was like a completely pointless thing for me to say. And it edits super quick, like I can get this edited and put out like insanely fast. So expect quite a bit of it I would assume. It's kind of relieving having a series that I can like, it's very stress free and I can sort of just record it whenever I want. Because it's on my laptop. It's also saving on my electric bill. Because <laughs> I don't have my Xbox turned on at the moment. Spear grew to level 5. Sand attack. Okay, that's going to be good for uh, the rock Pokemon if um, if we use that because we should have higher speed than the rock Pokemon by default. So I'm thinking if we use that to like, I think it lowers their defense or lowers their speed or something. That's probably going to be pretty good. But I want to kind of try and fight all of these. Bug catcher Doug. Okay, what does it do? Oh, it's a ground attack itself. I think it's just a speed related thing. Oh shit. <laughs> I didn't realise what he was using then. Oh, he's tra trying to poison me. Bloody Weedles. Oh, now he's quicker than me. Was he quicker than me before? I don't think he was. But that bloody string shot. Oh, my attack missed! Oh, get wrecked, you little shit. Okay, Spear grew to level 6. If we can get Spear to get, like, uh, is it Gust? If we can get Spear to get Gust, then that'd be great. We're going to probably have to do this with a couple of Pokemon. I might have to do quite a bit of grinding to kind of get a selection of Pokemon up to the sort of same level. Can I take out this Weedle just with Spear? Because that would be ideal. Because then Spear's going to get like a shit ton of XP. There we go. Whoa! Level 7. So I think Spear learns Gust like around level 10 or level 12 maybe? That feels about right. Oh my days. It's just going to keep on hardening. Oh my god, we got a critical hit on it. No, Spear! That bloody Weedle. That bloody Weedle. <laughs> um, okay, let's just keep tackling it, I guess. There we go, we got a crit on it. I might have to like... Oh, we got Withdraw. I can't remember if Withdraw is a good thing. I think that might boost our defense. What I might have to do is I might try and have to like... Skip past some of these. Oh, an Antidote! But I think, um, I think it's fainted, so I can't use it. Um, I don't believe I've got a revive. A town map, antidote, potion, no. I mean, it was prepared, like, it was like, look, you're going to be fighting a lot of Weedles, there's a high chance you're losing a Pokemon to poison here. Okay, fuck it, let's go for the grass. I will risk the grass. Not a Weedle, I shouldn't have risked the grass. I am tired of these motherfucking Weedles. Okay, where are we? Did I have to, like, did I need to go past him anyway? Oh, I went the wrong way. I will kill myself. <laughs> Imminently. Come on, Falafel. It feels so weird playing this on camera. It feels so weird playing this because like, the, I went through a big Pokemon phase when I was volunteering at a library before COVID started. Um, we were all playing it, like all the people that kind of like manned the desk there. Um, and we all went through a phase of playing it and like comparing teams and stuff and it was really, really fun. And I was gonna do my playthrough on that site. Um, but it was just easier for me to try and like sort it out on my laptop. Um, 
but I've wanted to do a playthrough of this for so long. I watched Purple Rodri uh, while I was in sixth form, uh, going through like a phase of Pokemon. I did like a bunch of Pokemon stuff for my A-level art projects, which was really, really cool to do. Um, and just generally, like, I really like the world of Pokemon. I have a lot of fun being in the world of Pokemon. I may have to swap out, though. I may have to swap out Falafel. Now, does Bubble do anything to grass- uh, to bug type? Oh! Not bad! I thought it was gonna be, like, horrifically bad. But actually, it's pretty powerful. Okay, let me... I'm just gonna quick save real quick. Just in case. I wanna make sure that, like, everything is working and everything's going fine. Fucking poison again. Okay, one minute. Let me use my antidote. And then we're going to use a potion. There we go. Fuck you, Weedle. <laughs> you little shit. I cannot wait for us to get to this gym and just, like, obliterate everything. It's going to be so satisfying. Because we're almost there. Yes, get wrecked. We can go get um, Spear revived as well from the Poke Center. Since he got, like, completely wrecked. Oh, there we go. We made it out. Skinny trees, cut down by cut. Okay. Okay, what about you? Yeah, I don't care about that. Can you get... You can get dragon types in Gen 1, can't you? Because I think you can get Dratini and Gyarados. And maybe Dragonite? Is Dragonite a, a Pokemon? <laughs> like an orange one? I think. Gen 1's usually my shit. But it's been so long since I played it, I just don't know anymore. <laughs> so I just take stabs in the dark at what's what. Right, let me just go ahead and drop off these Pokemon. Boom. And I think I'm gonna go see if I can find like a shop or something to get like revives or potions or just something to make this a little bit easier. Or to have like a bit of a backup plan. Okay. Here we go. Oh, we only got two battles. I thought we were gonna have like four. <laughs> I was getting like really pumped up and ready for this and then Apparently we've only got two. Oh, there is going to be like an onyx though, and that's going to be a pain in the ass. Go, Falafel! Oh shit, no, Falafel, you're not meant to be here. It's meant to be Spear. <laughs> oh, I changed the order. Okay, now swap out. Well, oh, that might mess me up a little bit. I might have to go heal up after this. Maybe not. <laughs> My days. Oh shit, okay. Apparently tackling is not on the menu at all. Spear grew to level 8. Okay, a sand shrew. Yes, let me switch to spear real quick. I need to remember to like... I keep going in and out of sped up mode, so I apologise if that's annoying for anybody. Um, but I'm like not really used to using it. I'm used to it just being constantly on sped up. Or not on sped up at all. So being able to like manually turn it on and off is really like disorientating. Also I tried to get rid of the bar at the top so that you guys didn't have to look at it after the first uh, episode. I just thought that it was kind of relevant because I was messing around with like the cheat menu and stuff to see if I could like speed the game up. <laughs> so it felt relevant to add a bit of context to what I was fidgeting with. Whee! Go for Laffle! And Spear! Holy shit, Spear's levelling up really quick. Gust! At level 9? Awesome. I don't really think 
Um, fly flying is like super weak to ground and rock, isn't it? So, not really that useful at the moment, but, okay. I'm gonna use a potion on Falafel. There we go. I don't know how much, I didn't check how much potions do. 20, okay, well I got like 15, so that's not bad. Hey up Brock, what up? Okay, sick, fine then, show me your best. Leader Brock would like to battle, Geodude. Fuck that Geodude. <laughs> we don't care about that Geodude. Bubble that Geo dude. Holy shit. Even if we fail against the Onyx, like, we're getting so much XP towards Sphere for this. It just seems worth it at the moment. Also, I'm not going to be doing, like, a Nuzlocke or anything, because I don't understand how to do it, and also, I'm not that great at the base game, so... Okay, what if I was to do, like, a Sand Attack? Oh shit. <sighs> what if we didn't do a sand attack? <laughs> oh, my poor little Pidgey just got buried. Poor Spear. Okay, I'm being binded, which isn't ideal, but I think that's like a continuous hurt thing. But we've just completely obliterated that Onyx. <laughs> oh my days. Level 13. Water gun. Yes. Give me water gun. What does withdraw do? A spray... Oh no. The user withdraws its body in its hard shell, raising its defense stat. Or the user wags its tail cutely, making the foe <laughs> lower its defense stat. So we can heighten our own, or we can lower the opposition. It's got a 100% accuracy, which is nice. Um... I want to keep Tackle. Usually I would probably get rid of Tackle. I think I'm I'm going to get rid of Tail Whip. Because I think hardening my own defense would probably be a little bit better. We need Water Gun like a thousand percent. And I'm sure that we can probably learn Tail Whip if it's actually useful, but I don't think it really is. I'm probably horrifically wrong, but we got the Boulder Badge. Which we need... Oh, we can use Flash outside of battle. Of course, a Pokemon must know the move Flash to use it. <laughs> we also got 1400, which is insane. TM39. A TM technical machine contains a technique for Pokemon. Using a TM teaches the move it contains to a Pokemon. A TM is good for only one use. So when you use one, pick the Pokemon carefully. Anyways, TM39 contains Rock Tomb. It hurls boulders at the foe and lowers its speed. Sick. Uh, okay. I think... Oh no, I'm thinking about uh, Viridian City. Are we in Viridian? No. We're in Pewter. Uh, I think it's Viridian City has like the side section that I wanted to go to, but that's fine. Uh, oh, we should probably go ahead and revive our spear because it's been completely buggered by that battle. I'll take your Pokemon for a few seconds. <laughs> Sick. I mean, now that Spear's in, like, uh, Gust mode, <laughs> we can go ahead and, like, actually take people on with it. Oh, Ollie, I'm glad I caught up to you. I'm Professor Oak's aide. I've been asked to deliver this, so here you go. We got the running shoes, motherfucker. Press the B button to run, but only where there's room for you to run. Which one is... I think it's this one is the B button? Dear Ollie, here is a pair of the running shoes for my beloved challenger. Remember, I'll always cheer you up. Don't ever give up. From Mum. That was weird. Oh, okay, so yeah. Oh, we can move, like, extra fast now. Okay, I need to try and level up my spear, my Pidgey. So, we, we are going to have to fight a lot of people. I can't remember who, if we have to go through that cave. 
before we get to the water gym. I'm really hoping we don't. <laughs> I will not be very happy about it. Boom. Fuck that Pidgey. Not Janice about to use another Pidgey. Hell no, my Pidgey's superior. Fuck your Pidgey. Oh, your Pidgey has fucked me. <laughs> Fuck your Pidgey. Get wrecked. See, I don't know whether to cut out these sections because it's literally just going to be me fighting trainers for like the next five to ten minutes. Um, and I don't know if that's really boring to watch or not. Viridian Forest. Oh, it's it's the same dude with a with another Caterpie. Oh, can we like one hit these? Oh, almost. Holy shit. Oh, that's insane. Oh my god, we almost won here. I'm going to try and get as much XP out of this as possible. <laughs> Please throw, like, a Metapod or something out. Oh, a Caterpie, okay. I'm going to try and one hit it. Yes! Fantastic. Because now I can go back and heal up my Pokemon. But yeah, I don't know whether to like cut out certain parts of the game because I know... I don't know. Hmm. I think there's a certain charm to Pokemon with how repetitive it is. But I don't want you guys to get bored. Um, I know that I won't because it's just like... For the most part, as long as your Pokemon are leveled up, it's quite easy. There's like a little bit of strategy to it when you're in certain parts of the game, but when you're mostly coming across like um, the generic kind of trainers like I am now, it's kind of easy. Oh, hi, I like shorts. They're delightfully comfy and easy to wear. <laughs> okay. Um, but at the same time, I don't want it to just be like a 10 part playthrough where I play like the large majority of it off camera. Because then it's like, well, what's the point? Um, but yeah, I don't know. It's something that I'm going to have to just sort of play around with, I guess. And hope that it turns out okay. Spear grew to level 13, so they should now be the same level. If not, Spear might be a little bit quicker. I'm going to have to go get food soon. I am starving. Ekans. Ekans. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why I do it in that voice? Ekans. Little Ekans. I don't like Ekans at all. Not a fan. Stop poison stinging me, holy shit. My Ek- my Ekans. The Ekans has just messed me up. I might have to go back and heal up. I was not expecting that. That amount of offense. Offense. I mean, we're going to be able to evolve Falafel pretty soon, which is sick. Uh, I don't know if there's a way for me to get, like, a grass-type Pokemon just yet. Do you know for the water gym? Because it goes rock, water, and then electric, does it not? Oh, I'm in the wrong place. <laughs> I'm in, like, the complete wrong place. I just throw, like, my dead Pokemon on the, on the store counter, just like, fix it for me. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to work my way through like this set of trainers. I'll see where it ends us up. Um, but otherwise, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, we got our first badge, which was pretty cool. Um, yeah, I know that this is a series that kind of came out of nowhere. I mentioned it very, very briefly before. Um, but I didn't think I would actually get around to recording it, and it's going pretty well so far. I'm enjoying it, and I'm hoping I get to complete the game. So, yeah, feel free to leave a thumbs up. It really helps the content and helps the channel. And go check out uh, some other content on the channel. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next episode of Pokemon Fire Red. Bye-bye.